Hello, good morning. We are back with another episode of the Bankroll Challenge. I should fold the 10 I suit at man. <laughs> I didn't see he was so short. Day 105, still NL25. Yeah, you know, that's the first mistake here. That's not a great start. Maybe we can hit a really good flop. First hand, you know? Ah, uh, no. This one sucks quite a bit. Unless we check it down. Nope. Nope. First mistake. Aces. Wow. The open limp the aces. We would have won the side pot though. That's not a good start, you know, with a mistake by me. Anyways, I hope you enjoy the highlights. Um, stay tuned for day 105. You know, spring and fall are kind of my favorite, um, how do you say, parts of the year. And uh, sometimes now with the changes, climate changes, I think it's a bit annoying. Sometimes it's gonna switch too fast now. Maybe in a week it's gonna get super hot, almost summer then, or in a few weeks. <laughs> almost skipping a season. Yeah, season, that's the word I was searching. Uh, which is quite annoying. Okay, I have no clue what that lead means here. Whatever. We get one call, which a bit, which is a bit scary, you know. I think we just call see a turn. There could be trips around. Nine is not great. Queen Jack gets there. Six seven. Jack seven, and they play really wide ranges, so they definitely can have it. Manu G940, good luck Alex, thanks man, appreciate it. Shout out. Wow, I thought I hit, I had aces, now I thought I hit the full house, but I don't. Now we have an easy fault on the diamond too. Sick, you know, I thought we had the aces. The dream, the dream spot, no. Man, the, the voice is not doing that great. Yo, messenger with the raid. Hello, welcome. Shout out. Did you stream so early today, man? Sick. All special in the set. Yeah, same here. Same here. We're gonna bluff here. I don't know what this could mean. And I'm gonna bluff race, whatever. What? What was that? He's calling. <coughs> what the heck? He's calling here. How is it called? We're not staying in a hotel. It's like a small club, I think. Jockey club or something. It's quite cheap. Cheaper than a hotel. I mean, still, I think we pay, we're in free and we pay like 4k or so for those three weeks, three and a half weeks. Um, but yeah, uh, less expensive than a hotel. Is it called Jockey Club? I'm not sure. Maybe I can search it up. I think it's called like that. Las Vegas Jockey Club. Yeah, I think it's that one. I'm gonna show you some pictures. And we're gonna overbat this one here. We're open ended. Probably giving up river unless it's a really scary one. I mean, maybe not, maybe not. Okay, diamonds we're gonna keep. We have four high and diamonds, you shouldn't have too many of those. There's not much left now. <coughs> diamonds should be our main bluffs here, you know? Mm. Alright, we get it through. Mm. 
15. 15. Poker challenge, which cash game stakes will you play in Vegas? Um, I haven't really decided yet. Probably 510, something like that. 25 maybe. 510 would be nice. The highest I've ever played live was 1025, but I'm not sure. I think my bankroll is too small to bring to Vegas for that. <laughs> Definitely too small, actually, not just. Um, yeah. You shouldn't have freeze force too much, so in theory, that's a decent flop for our range. I'm gonna bet flop and probably a lot of turns too. Checks, I might, I might block turn. And do suit it. What the heck? And do suit it. I think we want to bet this still. Uh, the king nine of clubs would be nice to have hearts at least. But still. Uh, you know, we want to fold him some ace queen and stuff here. I think we need to jam this river also. Just because we don't block the hearts. Maybe he's. I don't know if he's able to fold some pocket pants here. With my image, I'm not sure. No, the snap called kings. A <laughs> nice hand. We were dead. <laughs> Beauty off there. Uh, might, might be a bit spew. But once we get in there, I think we need to play it. We need to go follow through. Uh, turn? Turn, I wasn't sure. We get a call, nice. Some We need to get some money back now. Is king tail one? I'm just gonna flat this time. Nice flop for the ace king. Let's write it down here, king nine of suited, table two. We can look at it later, maybe it's complete spew. But I think with the poster it's tough to analyze. I'm gonna raise this one here. King nine suited, lost, which one did we have? The king jack suited. Which made us some money, fortunately. Table three. We have aces. Mm -hmm. We get a min free bet. I mean, good jam, but I don't mind for betting still. Good luck to us against King Six offsuit. Hold. What the heck? Now we take it down, nice. That's an annoying river, kind of. Can we have queens? We have gates of talents, which is nice. I think we check call river. We might bluff hands like Jack stands with one diamond, maybe. But it's really annoying. TGM aces here. I'm not sure. I don't know if he has queens in there, calling turn, maybe he has. But yeah, this one we can't really fold, let's see. I think he's able to bluff some hands, so I don't mind, I don't mind calling this one. And nine of diamonds, yeah, this sucks. Ooh, that's a nice flop. We're the 7 6 suited. Andre ET25, thanks for the follow. <laughs> Even more equity now, but they both call, so we're gonna be a bit careful here. Jack 10, 5 6, you know, some two pair they could have. Hopefully we see a river, you know, if he races there, it would be sick. Now we're just gonna call. Probably lead if we. I mean, the 
Ten is not an amazing out. Let's see. Clap should be should be decent. I think we lead. Hoping not to get jammed on. Huh? Let's see. Jared Grove, thanks for the follow. I think two pair and stuff straight should just call this. Mozart, another follow, thank you. He's tanking. I think he has 8-9. Please call, we need some money. <laughs> we need some money. This is a spot we're never gonna be bluffing in, in practice here. Like we always have it. I would never bluff three ways. Once one bets, one calls on the flush completing. Oh, please Raiden, no. No. Kings. And, and it's a lot of variance too. Sometimes they deviate a lot from optimal ranges. Yeah, and it's really, you know, it's just gonna float up some spots, which is kind of unnecessary. It's gonna increase variance a ton. Um, that's a good point, you know, to think it would be better to avoid those thin spots. And just cooler people with kings against queens, nice. <laughs> that's what we need, you know, this is easy game. I defended big plant here. Five. You shouldn't have that many, you know. Um, six acts, I think, is in his pre flap long range. So, unless he has pocket force, we should be good almost always with our six. Okay, now it looks really good. Could we check? I'm gonna go one third. Ship river? No, I'm not gonna ship. I think it's tough to get called by worse if we ship. He has a lot of sevens, eights, nines, tens, I think. I'm gonna go exploit if a bit smaller, like 27 or so. We have kings on the other table. In before he has quads. <laughs> We have kings. I squeezed. It was an open race. Call, call, call. I squeezed kings. I'm gonna see that one third here on seven reduce. Which seems like a really good flop. Good check turn. We get a call. Nice buy. Pocket fives. Yeah, that was that was decent for us. Uh, I'm gonna still. Okay, we get a snap bolt. Someone using a program on another PC is almost never gonna be possible to detect unless everyone plays with a cam or so. <laughs> Which maybe that's the future at some point. But I'm not sure. This could be one to bluff. I'm gonna I'm gonna check it back. We hit the flush draw. I'm gonna be calling turn. Hope for a clap one time. Clap 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 clap. No, the brickiest brick of all. <laughs> no, I, I don't think we can even bluff this. Unfortunately, it sucks to lose against Ace High, but I'm not sure if he would even pull that. Yeah, he's done a fart. He leads the ace nine five. Interesting. I guess we just call. I don't know what this could mean. Let's see a turn. Seems like a brick, you know. Some hands might pick up equity like Queen Jack of Spades, King Jack of Spades. What the heck, you know? I don't know. I think we call again, but the river's gonna be. 
river is gonna be tricky. Manu G, sub arrived, haven't seen notification. I've also seen nothing. Sorry man, no nothing coming here. Man! I think we fold, even though it wouldn't be the worst bluff catcher with the seven. Uh, but I don't know if he's bluffing enough here. He seems quite passive too. No, this this is an easy fold, I think, against him. No, Manu, no, stop it, man. Come on, I shouldn't say it, you know? I should say, do it, do it, then you don't do it, right? <laughs> Thanks, man, I really appreciate that, but there's no need, honestly, you don't have to. It's just uh, too much, too much money spent there. Uh, once more, you know, thank you so much. Uh, thanks uh, for gifting us up to Ollie. What the heck, we get raised. Wow. Let's hope for a 10 on the river. Or hearts. Hearts, 10 of hearts, both. Wow, that's amazing. That's amazing. Manu G bringing the good luck there. Yeah, it worked, Manu. Thank you so much. No wrong table. Sorry, guys. You couldn't even see it. I'm sorry. Just at the last second, man. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm gonna show it once more to you. It was just... Um, sorry, guys. We open cutoff, we see that small flop, we open that turn, he min raises with the ace 4, sick. And we get there on the river, really nice, and we get paid. Okay, let's get another one here, let's squeeze this one. No, I just wanted to change. Okay. the heck they both call I mean favorable flop for him for us here I'm gonna see that one third one fourth if he has a hand like pocket nines here he's gonna be in a tough spot you know and see has see me behind uh, I just hope he falls and and see me we're gonna call it off you know we have a gather too he has a super wide range uh, yeah we can really put some pressure here I think We calls, interesting. Can we click it back, you know? Man, this is a tricky spot now. Like, we're risking 27 to win 83. Click it back, I think, looks really strong. Let's try that, actually. Yeah. Okay, Jack-10, we have some equity. King or ace? No. <laughs> Man, this was... This was a sick spot here. I'm not sure if we played that well, I don't know. But I had some really deep stuff laying around there. We're down 6 euro, you know? Maybe this can be the hand which puts us into the... Into the green, yeah, you know? Yeah, it looks good. I think we're ahead quite often here. He's super loose. Compix can have a lot of hands. Yeah, we're definitely raising, getting this in against Kinka. This is too too cheap here. You could have jacks too, but whatever. Eight nines, you know. Eight six hold, hold. Yes, that's what we needed here, man. Man, what a roller coaster today. We got a huge hole in the middle. <laughs> But at the end, you know, running a bit above VV helped <laughs> to make the book a winning session today. Which is quite nice still. Not a huge step, but a small step back. <laughs> what are the blinds? Ooh, now I got it. This is NL25, so 10 cents, um, 25 cents. Here we even put the wrong date, man. This was yesterday, 30th. Go for it. At least a good start today into May. First of May. 
20, 23, and not 25. Exactly. Thanks, uh, Donkey Boost, for telling. Um, we made a profit of 786. Wow, that's a good sign here. 77k uh, hands, 770. And we're bankroll is at 796. Wow. 796.67.76. Okay. So we're in the day, it's not a serious price at the port of Fortuna. Grazie, Sandrino. Yeah, that helped. <laughs> yeah, small, small, small step here. Once more. We need to stay patient. We need to stay patient.